Welcome to Lone Wolf Outdoors. This company here sent me this product to review. I'm not sure why, but I'm glad they did. I, I wasn't going to do it, but I thought, heck, I'm gonna, I can use this, especially this coming week. And we're gonna see how it works. So I figured I'd unbox it right here. I haven't opened it up. And we'll see what's in it. It's a Saker Mini Electric Chainsaw. We're going to find out what's in it. Then we're going to charge it up and go cut some stuff up. All right. First of all, we've got the charger, charging cord. What's this? This is the battery. I don't know. If if it's charged or what, we will charge it before we use it. 20 volt, max 1.5 hour amp. Okay, here's the saw. Let me give you a little screwdriver. Take it out of here. It looks like it's got a, like a guard on it right here. Got a strap fit around your wrist. Looks like you gotta hold this button and this button at the same time. It's got a guard on it so you don't hit your hand, I guess. Let's see here if I can get it off my hand. And it comes with a little bottle of oil so you can oil your chain before each use. And a wrench. Like I said, it comes with this screwdriver. And this wrench where you can loosen or tighten your chain. And then here's the instructions. I'm going to go over them. I'm going to go and charge it. See how long it comes up to charge and I'll get back with you. Alright, I got the other thing there plugged up plug it right in that top hole right there you don't have no lights on it the battery but up here when I unplug it so I'm assuming that'll turn green when it's done and I'll check back later it is 512 we'll see how long it takes to Charge up. So the light is green. And the time is 626. Let's go use this saw. See what happens. Should be good. Alright, let's go try it on some wood. Alright, we're gonna demo this little chainsaw. It's safer. We got a pile of wood right here. And we put the battery in. First time I've ever done it. You got a safety button here. You gotta push them both at the same time. Hmm? It's a little louder than I thought it was gonna be. We're going to get us a piece of wood up here and try it out. Alright, I drove this piece of wood out of there. It ain't very big around. I'm gonna, what I'm doing this for, I'm going to give me some firewood so I can take camping this week. I got me some gloves on. I got glasses on. So we're going to see how it works. First time cutting. I 
won't cut nothing bigger than that. We'll cut it up, stock up, and see how it does. Good though. I can show you how to always take this loose when you get ready to clean it. Play jammed up. Okay, I do have. I see stuff coming out right here. The handy dandy tools that come with it. We'll find out what's wrong here. You just gotta blow it, blow it out in there. Get clogged up. Let's go and uh, finish on. It's a little bit big, but try it out. See.
bugs coming out of that wood. Six inch blade. See what's in it. Got two batteries. That's pretty cool. Oh, you got safety goggles. Here's a charger. There's the saw itself. Pretty good size. Okay. Oh, cool. You get two extra chains. That's pretty neat. You get the one that comes with it. And these two extras. And your instructions. Hey, look, you got some work gloves. Pretty cool. And you get your Phillips screwdriver. And your wrench. Take this off right here. And you have a bottle of oil for your chain. Pretty cool. Get two chains. We'll get these batteries charged up. We'll go out and tow some wood and see how it works. I'm getting ready to go camping tomorrow, so I'm going to go cut me some firewood and see how it works. Stay tuned. That's one thing I did notice. It comes with a little LED thing where you can check your battery level. Listen, here's full charge. Check this out. Alright, both of them full charged. Cool. We'll try them out. Takes some of this oil put on here. Oh, they're lubed up a little bit. Alright. We're gonna get some of this wood right here. I'm gonna cut some of it. little case makes it handy. So it's everything you need. I'm, I'm going to try to wear these. Of course, I have regular glasses. I'm going to oil this up. This is a six inch bar. You got to push this button and this one. Gloves. They got little grippy things on it.
Let me see if I can get me a piece of wood. Gotta watch for copperheads here. Alright, I got me a piece here. Let's see what it does on this. It's about half rotten, be a big, big good to burn. Not too bad. Check the battery. Still full, which it should be. See if we can cut that big one. Gonna watch the snakes here. Been here for a while. Not bad, one-handed. Well, if I can get it out of there, if I get snake bit. All right, I'm gonna try to cut this two before. See how it happens. Let's do one more. pretty good let's see how this thing does on the doing the lean yeah, that's pretty good I'm pruning yeah. That's pretty good. Let's get this one here. This is a great little pruning tool. Let's try. Saker did send me this originally. This is the four inch. This is a six. I got this one today. I just showed you what it does. Unboxed it. I unboxed this one too, and I'll put some of that stuff in the video. It comes with one battery, and it don't have the LED thing. It comes with charger, cord, and your tools, your screwdriver, and your wrench, and a bottle of oil. It does not come with any safety glasses or anything like that. Yesterday, I did have issues with this one. It was overheating a little bit. So, I let it cool off and it worked fine. I did cut this wood with, all, with, with the four inch. So that's gonna burn good at camp this weekend. So, like I said, it has issues, but for pruning and stuff like that, where you're not just hammering down on stuff, it'll work fine. So I hope this uh, helps anybody out there wanting to buy it.
I'm not getting paid for it. They sent it to me for a review. So, that's my honest review. I do like this a little bit better. It's just, but I find this one to cut better. Just in my opinion. I don't know the cost on this stuff. I guess different sites have different price points. So, hope this helps you. And uh, I'll show you my my fire when I get there and I'll end this video. Appreciate it. Finally made it down here camping. Cut the fire with this uh, little mini chainsaw. I don't have much to compare it with. It done okay. Um, it needs a few little things like a bigger motor on a six inch. So I got a fire over there. Go on. So I hope that answers anybody's questions. It does work. But it needs a bigger motor on this one right here. I'll show you uh, my camp. We have some visitors here. How you doing, fellas? It helped me cut my firewood for this time. It was real quick. I hope you find this helpful. Appreciate it.